It's time for the Matt LaCroix Show on Fox Sports 1460. Brought to you by the Holiday Inn Middletown. Now with today's show, here's Terry Byram. Before tonight's ball game with the Hartford Yard Goats, game two of a four-game series, I'm here with manager Matt LaCroix. And Matt, another good one yesterday, won a, a second straight game and snapped the Yard Goats' uh, nine-game winning streak. Yeah, I mean, uh, when you face a team with that, that type of pitching and uh, – they got some really good position players. They have a pretty good team. Been playing well. Uh, we did some things that were that that I was very pleased with. We executed. Got some big hits for two outs. We executed some situations. Uh, we ran the bases very aggressively. We pitched pretty good. So uh, it's good to come out and, and beat a team with with uh, uh, the way we did and and uh, the quality of team we beat was good. The big at bat in the game. Chris Postick batting with two outs. Uh, you guys are down three to one. And uh, he uh, he had struck out on a couple of off-speed pitches his at-bat before. Uh, Hernandez threw him a couple of off-speed pitches that he took for balls, got the fastball, and lined it to left field. Yeah, I mean, he, he, he saw the ball up. Uh, he laid off some balls down in the zone. Um, real quality at-bat for him and a uh, big one for us because it kind of uh, shifted the momentum our way. Mapes uh, uh, started uh, – he took advantage of that and, and went uh, – Two more solid innings, and uh, uh, but very, very proud of our club. I mean, they they've been they've been getting after. We've had chances, we just hadn't been able to get that hit, and for Bostic to get that hit, and then sack, uh, uh, getting that big sack fly at the end uh, proved to be a really big spot. So, guys, just got to keep going, having quality at bats, swinging at strikes, attacking in the zone, uh, throwing the ball over the plate, and making plays on defense, and we should compete every night. Tyler Mapes last night with a single and then a double. He has four hits already for you guys. I mean, I, you know, pitchers usually want to talk more about their their hitting if they get to hit and they hit well than their pitching. And I imagine he'd be no different if uh, we talked to him today about this. Well, it's funny because I asked him uh, after I took him out, did he hit in college? And he said no. It's kind of surprising because he can handle the bat uh, really well. And uh, you know, he kind of put me in a funny spot when he hit that double last night. And uh, uh, you know, fortunately, I was able to get. Uh, uh, guy ready because uh, I just didn't seem comfortable with him staying out there on the bases and and uh, uh, but uh, just one of those things that uh, really really proud of him. I mean he's just a gamer, competitor, and and uh, hopefully he can continue his success on the mound. And Coda uh, Glover pitched a couple of innings and then Brian Harper finished. He gave he gave up the home run in the ninth inning, but he, he left him out there and he finished the ball game and pitched well. Yeah, I mean uh, he's been really good for us. Uh, you know Coda. Uh, is new and put him in a big spot there we needed to get him two innings of work and then harper uh hadn't been able to give him really that big opportunity yet and uh, last night was it and uh, he gave up a home run but he settled down pitched out of it and got his first save so uh you know hopefully he continue to throw well because we'll use both of those guys on the back end of our games rafael batista had three more hits which makes back-to-back games with three hits and it, I know we've talked about this before, but with Rafael Bautista, when he gets on base, that just changes the complexion of your team. Yeah, I think so. And, and if we can get Defoe going and getting some hits, uh, that'll put even more pressure on the defense. But Bautista keeps having quality at bats, uh, swinging at strikes, uh, putting the ball in play, putting pressure on defense, stealing bases. He just makes things happen. He makes pitchers do things they're not used to doing, and uh, even managers, you know, they have to throw over, do things to speed up the running game. But, uh, you know, he's been a, a pleasant surprise, and hopefully he can continue to success because he, th- he makes our team go. All right, Matt, thanks a lot. Good luck tonight. Thank you.